Hello students, uh, we will be continuing with our session of greatest coefficient from the binomial theorem topic. So in our previous video we learnt about a topic of binomial uh, greatest coefficient for binomial expansion. Today we will be trying to do a sum of this thing. So let's begin. So the question that we have over here is fairly very straightforward. So we have summation 10cr into 20c m minus r where r goes from 0 to m. And this summation is maximum when m is equal to we need to find out the value for which this structure uh, is maximum so we have the option a is 5 option b is 10 option c is 15 and option d is 20 so these are the options that we've been given so now let's begin so what we have over here is that if we write summation where r goes from 0 to m so 10 cr so what is 10 cr so 10 cr is basically we can write it down as the coefficient of what can we write it down as coefficient of x to the power r um, in the expansion of 1 plus x whole to the power 10. So this can be written down as co f of x to the power r in 1 plus x whole to the power 10. Okay, very straightforward. So this is the 10 cr term into into we have another com another term that is 20 c m minus r where r goes from 0 to so this is basically another coefficient coefficient of x to the power m minus r in the expansion of 1 plus x whole to the power 20 so we can write it down as coefficient i'm writing in short as co f so co f of x to the power m minus r in 1 plus x whole to the power 20 so this is the expansion. So we have summation 0 to um, r goes from 0 to m and in coefficient of x to the power r in the expansion of 1 plus x to the power 10 and we have into coefficient of x to the power m minus r in the expansion of 1 plus x uh, to the power 20. So this is the expansion that we are looking forward to. So what will be what does it ultimately give us? So ultimately this gives us if we multiply this 1 plus x to the power 20 into 1 plus x to the power uh, 10, the height is 10, here is 20, then we have 1 plus x whole to the power 30 and x to the power r into x to the power m minus r so basically we get x to the power m so if we all keep on if we keep on um, adding it up for individual r's where r goes from 0 to n we ultimately get that this is nothing but equal to coefficient coefficient of x to the power m in 1 plus x to the power 30. and what is the coefficient of x to the power m in 1 plus x whole to the power 50 so this is nothing but equal to this is nothing but equal to 30 c m so this structure so this structure that we are looking for ultimately comes down to 30 c m now when is 30 c m maximum so this is what we are looking forward so now as you can know as you know the 30 here 30 is what that is basically the even number so if the n is even then we know that the greatest coefficient always happens when n is uh, greater coefficient happen for n c n by 2 n c n by 2 so here m is equal nothing for now we can write that for for 30 c m to be maximum will have for 30 c m to be maximum will have m will be equal to 30 by 2 and that will be equal to 15 which is nothing but the option c so as you can see very straightforward answer for 30 cm to be maximum we have m equal to 30 by 2 which is m which is option c and this is the correct option so this is the way um, this is an application that we where we use the concept of greatest coefficient to solve out this structure as you can see very straightforward sum and if you have uh, we'll maybe we'll not uh, so this is the sum that we tried over here so you can try other sums at home and in case you have any trouble regarding the same then you can comment uh, in the comment section below and just mention the question or any way you can get contact us um, by commenting in the comment section below and if you have any doubt regarding the same then um, we'll try to get back to you and help you out in that very matter so till then, uh, keep up with the good work that you are putting for our preparation for your exams and thank you very much.